Amen. Amen. Well, thank you once again for making it to the fourth NGP National Day of Prayer of the Ladies of Substance International Network. And now on to another great mom of mine. She is my spiritual mother. Amen. Amen. With 41 years of ministry, being a personal secretary to the late Christian legend, Archbishop Benson Idahosa for 12 years in Nigeria. You can tell what she carries. Yes. Mama Christine is founder and general overseer of Solid Rock Chapel International. And the church, the head office is on the rock. She's a woman of faith. You should see, you should go there to see. The last time I was going there with two members of Lozen, they were quiet in the car. I turned my back and I saw them shivering. I asked them, what is it? Are you a person? Hey, maybe I get a good idea. That tells you the kind of faith this woman has. Mama Christy is full of dynamism. No wonder we see her as the mother of charismatism. And she has taken this dynamism all over the world, Africa and beyond. She carries with her the grace of God for miracles, signs, and wonders. An author and humanitarian. Thank you for standing up. She deserves more than this. I want you to help this woman of God to deliver the word of God like fire this afternoon. Because she carries fire. Open up and receive the beautiful ministry of the Holy Ghost. Through God's handmaiden, Reverend Dr. Christy Joe We stand for a few minutes. I want us to sing this song. It's a girl's song. We are honoring Ghana. Is there anybody here who is 61? Where is somebody 61? Come, come. I want just one person.
the boat. Yeah. Left the boat. Eh? Yeah. God is the owner of Ghana. Yeah. He will never forsake us. Yeah. Yeah. At 61, we are grateful. Amen. Amen. We are grateful. Amen. Amen. Today is not only about praying for Ghana. It's about being grateful to God for planting us in a nation for Ghana. One thing about Ghanaians, we love people. Yes. We love each other. My late father, may he so rest in peace. My father will meet you on the road. He doesn't know you. Hello. He will treat you like he has known you from Adam. <laughs> Michael Yavitete. He ended his life by Jim Park. He was such a sweet person. Today I'm making new friends. Amen. Huh? Yeah. I'm making new friends. Yeah. I just made a friend now. <laughs> My fire fell off and she went down and brought it for me. Ghana is still strong. Amen. Ghana is still ready to deliver. Amen. Give somebody a smile and sit down for me. <laughs> Hallelujah. Amen. I like what I'm seeing, which means that next year we are going to plan bigger and better. Amen. 
จะในชนไม่ได้ I want to congratulate my daughter and my son I call him apostle There are people who are not qualified they are carrying title this one is more than qualified I'm gonna I call a prophet because I see what they don't see and I know that at four years this is just the beginning God bless you for the good work that you do Lossie, congratulations when I came Apostle was delivering, and um, I've called you in my heart because you blessed me, Pa. You blessed me, Pa. You already told some of the things I was going to talk about, so thank you for helping me. Amen. Holy Spirit, you have taken the lead. You are doing what you know to do best. Breathe upon your word and have your way. Heal that brother, heal that sister. Even those who are watching by the internet. Do something extraordinary because of Ghana. Let them tie their testimony and their miracle to save much. In the mighty name of Jesus. Amen. Amen. I have a short delivery of titled Put Ghana First. Ghana first. Put Ghana first. Tell two people by your side, put Ghana first. Put Ghana first. You told only one person. Tell the last person again. Amen. Amen. Some thoughts were running through my mind on our way here.
I'm reading Nehemiah chapter 1, verse 1 to 3. Don't worry about this cup. Son of Akalia, in the month of Kishle, in the 20th year, while I was in the citadel of Susan, I intentionally started with many Ghanaians in foreign lands. I'm a actor of greener pastures. Do you know as soon as they arrived there, they forgot about the reason why they went there. Mm -hmm. But Nehemiah didn't forget the reason why he went to Shushan. Yes. Oh, bless Nehemiah didn't forget. And also about Jerusalem. They said to me, those who survived the exile are back in the province. And they are in great trouble and disgrace. The wall of Jerusalem is broken. And its gates have been burned with fire. Nehemiah in the Hebrew tongue means the Lord comforts. Here is somebody whose name is the Lord comforts and yet he's not comforted. Because he's thinking about his home country. How many times do you think about Ghana? Those who have left, they are there in a brochure, nice things. What are your dreams? Are you dreaming of coming to help build the new Ghana? Or you are there thinking about making money to come and build a mansion. Ben over other, you'll be shocked. Oh, yeah, for any of you, you know, I'm a boy. I went to Dubai recently, and somebody took us around and was telling us the history that Nigeria used to give Dubai rice and oil to eat because they were nomads or whatever. Today, go and see. We were told the story of seven watchmen. I hope I'm still looking good. <laughs> seven watchmen who came together to school their children, give them good education. We come together, we school our brother's child, we come together, we school your children, now, the houses where they were watchmen, they bought it. When you are together, you can do powerful things. I said, when you are together, when you come together with one mind, you can do powerful things. You can do incredible things. The person in Kumina is too much. Group that were trying to rebuild the 
Every time they didn't allow them. The Sambalas and Tobiases did not allow them. It is unfortunate that any time you want to do something good, there are always Sambalasis and Tobiases. This morning I was watching television and some people were discussing why should they build a mini Greek cathedral? Blah, 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 blah. Where are they going to get the money from? Ghana is not like other countries. When you go to the market, you don't ask, Mami, we are some, we are some. What is it? No, you're a pastor. You don't do that. You buy the food. We are one people. We love each other. So why do you want to instigate all kind of unhealthy debates? At the end of the National Cathedral. You are not a good citizen. You are not a good citizen. We love ourselves. Let us be. One of my sons here right now, the mother, clock 91 last year. I was the one who helped her to cut the cake, a Muslim. A Muslim, a Ghanaian. Nobody should put family nyama nyama into our gari. Let us live as one people. Let us build a healthy Ghana. Whatever mistakes were made in the past, let's give Ghana a new face. There was a war 
around the whole city. Only one gate. That's why when the spies went to Rahab's house, they saw them. Get to come in. And they realized that ah, they haven't come out. But when they went to inquire from Rahab, so oh, they've gone. Meanwhile, she had kept them. Are you keeping your family secret? Or you are telling everybody that in our family is only mad people, <laughs> drunkards. So. Before somebody can get information from you, the person must be close to you. You saw those two men Apostle talked about, Big Tani and whatever Tani. They were the eunuchs who took care of the king. Because their kakai doesn't work. So they are the ones who take care of the king, the king's wives. And yet they were planning evil against the king. The Bible says in Psalm 102 verse 6 that we should pray for the peace of Jerusalem. So that when Jerusalem is at peace, you too, you will be peaceful. The man of God said, when they started shooting, blah, 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 he couldn't do the program until there was calmness. Nehemiah took the challenge upon himself. After he fasted, he went to see the king. You can't go and see the king with a frown face. was so endowed with so many ideas. What did he do? After prayer, he went to see the king. Under normal circumstances, you cannot go and see the king with a frown face about people. <laughs> but because God was on his case, the king overlooked his mood. Yes. <laughs> 61. God will overlook our mood. Yeah. Because seriously, if I ask you some intimate questions now, you say, hey, Mommy, hmm. you say, when Nehemiah went to see the king, he didn't go to see the king for himself. Because where he was, he was very comfortable. Yes. And so, he could have just told himself that, Charlie, me, where I am, free air condition, free air, free everything. So, but no, he took a step of faith. And that is what I want us to do today after my submission. Everybody will take a step of faith from today to do something for Ghana. Amen. You may not have a big microphone like mine, but somewhere, somehow you meet people, you interact with people. Let the conversation be a healthy conversation yes. about Ghana. Amen. Because every time we are pulling ourselves down, we are saying things about our leaders, we are not saying they are correct. But you see, the more we talk about the negative, we will not see anything positive happening. Were you not happy last week? Black queens made us proud. Emma, you don't know, you don't watch TV. The black queens won the Wasu Cup. They brought the cup to Ghana. They beat Nigeria. They beat Africa. Coast. They beat all the coast. And their lesson, and their coach is a Ghanaian woman, Debra Funyu. Clap for the coach. Do you see where I'm going? This is complex under 13. Omusu omu piti Canada. Omu piti things at Kesia Kesia. Omu piti Dubai. Omu di kafu Dubai Ghana. Yete ne ma mo Ghana. You see, all is not lost. Yes. The corruption.
watching, they are there. Those who came because they want money, they are there. But there are other good things in Ghana that you and I can propagate. We should fuel the good things. Hallelujah. Neymar knew God could use his talent to get the job done. From that moment he arrived in Jerusalem, everyone knew who he was. He was in charge. He organized, managed, supervised, encouraged, met opposition, confronted injustice, and kept going until the walls were built. Nehemiah was a man of action. Be a man, a woman of action. If you are doing something and nobody opposes you, then it means what you are doing is of no value. It's true. More than 90 years earlier on, people tried. It didn't work. But when it got to Nehemiah 10, he said, what didn't work for other people will work for me. He was a man of prayer. He had organizational structures in place. When he arrived in the city, in the night, he went to survey the whole area. There are some things when you are doing, don't let people see you. Don't let them even know what you are doing. If you are on your property, your new land you bought, hey, are you coming to our neighborhood? Tell them, oh, I came to visit somebody. <laughs> there are people who don't think you deserve more than you have now. Yes. Why will governors, Sambalan and Tobaya, government officials, huh? They confronted Nehemiah. What have you come to do? They criticized him. Hey, this thing you are doing, eh? even if a fox go over it, it will break. It doesn't matter. It doesn't matter how to do it still for karma. Because they won't get 10%. So they are opposing him. Who he had yena obi enya ni chopo kakra wamuwa obe kiti wu. Nehemiah took a risk. When you read on, they wrote him open letters, breaking news. Nehemiah is trying to overthrow the king. He didn't mind them cry. Sometimes ten deaf ears on those who criticize you. <laughs> the man who invented the globe, he was partially deaf. So if you are telling him, hey, bro, you've done this thing 500 times, it's not working, you are still doing it. One day. <laughs> to do. The king said, my son, I will help you. It didn't end there. I told you that anytime you decide to do something that is of worth, there will be people to assist you. Amen. The king gave him letters to his friends. They gave him timber. They gave him all the needed materials for the project. Amen. Somebody say I receive it. And you know what? The journey took four months. Journey to go and rebuild the broken walls took four months. Kept on going back. Hey, no confusion. Guy, I pay him. Man, never bother me. Oh. I should have just rested in the citadel. Listen to me. He let go of all his pleasures. You can't be serving the king wine and not drink some. Learn more first. He would taste it before giving the king. If there was poison, he would die first. Hear me? Anybody who doesn't want Ghana to prosper, God will deal with them. Yes.
Nehemiah. He prayed, but he didn't end there. I know you are a prayerful man, a prayerful woman. Me too, I pray. <laughs> Our first church auditorium, we built it in 60 days. Wow. I'm not kidding. 60 days. I was carrying mortar. I didn't say, hello, brothers and sisters, you know, I'm Reverend Dr. Christy Joseph. You see me, my bent hair. I can't carry mortar. I carry mortar. <laughs> What Nehemiah did. Nehemiah got involved. So the people were motivated to work together. Because if this man has come to repair the walls and he's not just sitting down giving instructions, but he's involved, we must also get involved. Yeah. That three people get involved. Yeah. Nehemiah chapter 6, 15 and 16. So the walls, the wall was finished in 20 and 5th day of the month Evo, in 52 days, 52 days. And it came to pass that when all our enemies say uh-huh uh -huh. head thereof and all the heathen that were about us saw these things they were much, much cast down in their own eyes for they perceived that this work was wrought of our God That 90 years couldn't do in 52 days. The work was done. Germany, Obi, Essim Penny, because a crow, we are seeing a crow baby in Ghana Penny. A young said, Oh, what I die now. So, I am to me in 90 years. I am back to me in 52 days. I came with a prophetic mantle. I'm giving you 52 days. This one, it is God. Amen. That to be your testimony. That to be your story. Amen. Somebody was married for 10 years. No issue. By the time they see you in your maternity, hey. they will say, hey. This is God. But, eh, uh, eh, uh, 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 
Maria and Casol Perolucci. We love ourselves. We are proud of our country. Now, Andy, if you have a husband and you love that husband, will you be talking bad about that husband? No. If you have a wife and you cherish that wife, will you be telling people that, hey, this is my wife? <laughs> That's what we are doing to Ghana. That's what we are doing to Ghana. Me, I'll always look for one beautiful thing about you. And amplify that thing. One of my pastors here will tell you, as for mama, she doesn't look at the tones, but she looks at the rose. Amen. Let's find the rose in Ghana. Amen. And let's stop, stop talking bad about our country. Let's try it. Let's try it. Ghana will become a place that people will be rushing to come because they have had good things about the people who inhabit Ghana. Put Ghana first. Ghana is all we have. Put Ghana first. At 61, how are you treating Ghana? Ghana, the queen of Ghana. Kofi Ghana. Ghana. Our schools. We send our children to go and learn. Teachers will be raping our children. If you are thinking good of the country, you will not involve yourself in silly things. By force, you set up microfinance, whatever. You want to help people. When they give you the money, then you run away. You are not promoting the country now. Today with internet, people are watching us. Now we are here, how come we believe it's big? 200,000 and a half. Oh, two. Oh. Now it is 200,000. So I think I'm going. My time is about to work. You are not giving a good image of God. Because you have come. 
whatever your needs are, heaven will supply. I'm hearing in my ears. There are people here who are trusting God for the fruit of the womb. By this time next year, you will bring your babies wherever you get. And when I came to pray for God, God has visited me. Amen. Looking for a husband? God can orchestrate something. Amen. You'll be surprised. Amen. God gave Nehemiah favor. Amen. From the beginning of the journey to the end of the journey, people were there to support him. People who didn't know him, they were ready to work with him. Amen. That. Yeah. Jesus name. They were not ready to listen to those who have been there, Sambala and Dubai. So long was this the no more than that. But Neymar, they are very normal. When the king asked him, how long will you be away? The Bible was silent on that. But Neymar ended up staying for 12 years. Yeah. So, in 12 years, on a scowling, no addition. The God who took him from the city and took care of him. Yes, yeah. Yeah. Oh, my God, you know what I say? Yeah, 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 some was. Can we be ashamed? God will take care of him. Yeah. I'm not saying don't travel abroad. I will encourage you to yeah, travel because you are on Don't go and stress yourself out. You see where some of them are living. Come on, watch me. So what we do? So baby, I will buy it. We can now pay that with nine for it. Now I will buy one more from her. Nehemiah was ready to make a sacrifice. He was ready to take a risk. We are building for God. The people are opposing you. You are not building for yourself. You are building for your country. They are calling you names. Pretend to be them. Oh, after we built our auditorium in six months, a man of God asked me, is it a zinc rich room or what? I said, come and look at it. Because they didn't expect that you can build a block building in 60 days. 60 days, Mrs. Sixty days. 60 days. 60 days. Two months. Two months. Yes. Yes. Two months. Yes. Anna. Yes, I'm yes. 60 days. Daniel, you can go and look at it. North Canadian, your business is very good. But they say, Mami has the cathedral, I can see it. I swallow it. Oh, no. I don't see it in six months. Because it's a me, Mami. Let's be what we must see. I'll be born in six months. Uh, we ten months. Ten months. Nine months. Ten 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 months. We are not in competition. People are cooking what here, and sporting it. Giving Ghana a good name. People who are carrying cocaine are out. Giving Ghana a bad name. Join the people who are giving Ghana a good name. Finally. Don't go to functions late. I asked what time I should be here. I got here a few minutes past the time I was giving because there was a little delay at home. But me, ask them, I don't go anywhere late. Don't go anywhere late. Amen. Don't go to your work late. Amen. Don't go to church late. Amen. Don't go to any function that concerns Ghana late. Amen. Ghana doesn't like late news. I'm a Ghana in 61. Or what or crap. If Ghana is growing old. Let's do what will make I'm a Ghana eight graceful. When I tell Prophet Zagna, my schedules and my things. Hey, not me. 
when I grow old, I want to be like you. <laughs> Hallelujah. Yes. I'm coming from a program, 10 o'clock in the night, the following morning, which was so, that is like that. So I tell people that if you are sick, you can't be going up with that. So thank God for life. Yes. I speak strength into yes. everything. Yes. I know your needs will be hurting. Receive strength. There is much work ahead of us. We must rebuild the broken world. In the midst of opposition, make up your mind. Are you good kind of person? In Jesus' name. Oh, I said, pack your things, let me wash them for you. <laughs> 